Hello, my friends. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're ready for another YouTube video from your old buddy, DadCrab73. We're back here in the sky playing some 1.10. Modern Minecraft, man, you know we're playing Sky Factory, and there is no doubt. Oh, man, I could just stand up here forever and just kind of hang around, messing around with random stuff. Man, I love it so much. I do indeed. I do indeed. <laughs> oh, boy. It's so much fun. Man, we got to get to work today because last episode we took care of our tinkeries, tinkeries, our tinkers smeltery. Man, I'm cranking out some nickel. I was just emptying, working on emptying out some stuff over there in my little storage chest that I've got where I've got all my ores for my sieve operation. And the reason I had to do that is I was trying to grind out some diamonds. I have seven. Well, that might not be enough, but I think it's going to be enough to get started. All right, so auto sieving. Let's take a look here. So the first thing I was looking at was iron stiffened meshes and what we can get out of those guys. So if we sieve sand, you know, we get these guys, and then we get some other odds and ends. We get ancient spores, which I think are cactuses, if I remember. We get some quartz enriched iron dust. We get cocoa beans, yellorium, and prosperity shards. All of that stuff we need. So that's sand. If we do dust, man, we get redstone, and we get oh, this crazy stuff. I don't <laughs> we have so much of that. But we get all these ores as well. We get gunpowder, blaze powder, which we also will need. And if we do gravel, we get the big daddy. We get the diamonds. And then finally, if we do crushed and stone, we get this stuff. Uh, but we're not worried about that at the moment. So I think that gives us about everything that we need. So if we look at flint stiffened mesh, what do we get? Cactus seeds. Oh, ancient spores. Mushrooms. Mushrooms. That's to make mycelium. Yeah, we're going to need that down the road. So if we do a flint stiffened mesh, we get, you know, the same kind of stuff. I guess we get a couple other little odds and ends. We get some uh, bone meal with dust. We get lapis with gravel and then soul sand and dirt we get a whole bunch of stuff some mineral saplings i kind of want those and let's see here so string mesh let's take a look and see what we need if we do topiary grass we get tons of oh, redwood tree you know i'm going to make one of those for sure we get our berry bushes we get a bunch of different saplings which is kind of cool uh, we get uh, that's the same thing so we don't need to worry about that that's bone meal um, sponges we're not going to be doing anytime soon and gravel we get flint soul sand oh we get these crazy things okay interesting and then end stone and then dirt yeah so i don't know if we need a string and then a diamond what's the deal here let me just make a look make a take a look and see so if i'm doing sand i get all this stuff if i'm doing dust i get that stuff if I'm doing gravel, I get that stuff. So it's a bigger chance for diamonds. But it's going to be a while until I can do that. So here's what I'm thinking I'm going to do. We're going to have, I think, our first go-round here. And I want to try to get started on this and not be messing around too much. Let's break some of this stuff down because I need it to stop. Let's gra gather up all this stuff. We're going to keep this chest there. Actually, you know what I should do? Because that's a ton of gravel. Can I make one of those like chest movers? I think so. Chest mover. I just need like a wooden one. I don't think I need anything too crazy. So I have, um, uh, I don't have any of the stuff I need. Of course not. Uh, there's a stick. So I need a stick and then I need some planks. Let's just grab some of these like so. Okay. And we'll go like this and we will make one of these guys. And I should be able to move that chest. I'm pretty sure. There we go. So let's go over here and see if we can grab it. I know it like makes us walk really slow. Yeah. Do, 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 do. So we'll just bring this guy over here because we're going to have to probably hammer through all this stuff. And we'll just lay that right there for now. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that works. Okay. So I need to get... Let's get um, some building blocks out here and figure out what we're going to do. So to get gravel, it's pretty simple, right? We have a whole chest full of it. So that's not a big deal. But I want to make sure that we have some sort of storage 
capabilities. Can I make a ender chest yet? I bet I can. I don't have an ender pearl. Mm, okay. Okay, we can't make an ender chest yet. I would like to get one, but that's okay because we can convert once we get that. I need to make some end stone. I think I can make end stone. Yeah, I can do that, right? Um, lava, glowstone. Yeah. So I bet we could get some ender lilies pretty quickly and start working with some of that. But we'll work on that. That'll be an opportunity for us to do something down the road. So we got to figure out how we're going to do layout. So if I put... Let's use these as... We're probably going to make some storage crates. Um, let's see. So if I go like crate, crate, crate. Right? And then we go um, sieve, sieve, sieve. Okay. So we have three sieves. And then above that... Do I have a different block I can use? Uh, I can't use gravel for now. And then above that we have... So this will be... We'll treat this like our, and, and in the past, you know, I tried to have like everything centralized and we used Ender IO conduits and things like that. Man, we're not doing that this time. I'm just going to have different um, like processing facilities, if that even makes any sense whatsoever. Okay, so we're going to have, so this will be auto hammer, and then we'll have a cobblestone generator above auto hammer, sieve chest right and then we're gonna have to use ender io or no we're gonna have to use um transfer nodes from extra utilities to move stuff around so that'll be the iron sifting setup and then we're gonna have to go like that let me get up here a little bit and then we're gonna have like that so what we'll do is we'll have um so we're gonna have Auto hammer. No, actually, this is going to be. Let's get a get our uh, deal here, so we can make sure we use our block types. Even these aren't the best block types, but that's what we're using. Okay, we're going to do hammer, hammer to turn stuff into sand, and we're going to sift, right? So, so chest sieve hammer hammer and then over here we've got to do chest sieve hammer hammer oh dang it hammer right so we need one two three we need six hammers so we can bust down all the cobblestone into its component pieces and i think that's going to work and then everything's going to flow into sieve so we need six hammers and we need uh, three sieves let's just knock this stuff down Okay, so now that I know what I need, I think I should be good to go. Here, how about we uh, do that, and that, and that. Okay. All right, so I got to make six auto hammers. Whew, that's going to be a lot of diamonds. I have one, so I need five more. So I need, uh, oh, I need a couple more diamonds. Let's just run. Let's see if we get lucky. We need one more diamond. No, I need uh, three more diamonds. So let's see if we get lucky and just run this little bit of gravel that we have through the sieve. Do I have any more gravel? I do. Okay. And we'll run that through. We need some diamonds. We need three diamonds, and then we should be in good shape. I love having 16 of these guys. I know one of you guys said I could go all the way to uh, 25, I think. 25 of those guys. Let's run this through. Do I have any more gravel? No. Oh, oh there's a, a couple diamonds. Let's put this in there. One diamond out of that deal? Dang it. Okay. That's all right. I can put that there. The other thing that it'll do is it'll make it so this stuff isn't like flinging all around. Go there. Uh, there. Okay. Any other things laying around here? There's something over there. I think that's... And then something here. Okay. Okay. So there's all that. Yes. Yes. Okay. So I need to go... And how many diamonds do I have now? I have eight. So that'll allow me to make four 
auto hammerers. I need to make six, so or I need to make five. So I need to get some more diamonds. I tell you what, let me jump off camera real quick and see if I can't grind out those diamonds. There's no reason for you guys to have to hang around and watch that stuff. I mean, it's kind of boring. And pretty soon, we're just going to sit back and let the good times roll, so to speak. How are we doing here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I love the Tinker Smelter. You just load it up and just walk away and let it do its deal. All right, I need to, I need to make another chest. Pretty soon we're gonna be getting rid of some chests, so don't worry. Don't like go. Oh, you know what? Actually, we're gonna do. One of you guys, I think it was uh, Mr. Sloan, said, "Hey man, you should make one of those crafting tables on a stick. Then you won't have to run around all crazy like all the time." Let's see what we can do. See if we can't make one of those. So if we go like this, and we need a sign, right? And I'm pretty sure a wood sign will work. I hope. Okay, and then we need a crafting bench. And then if I think we put these guys together like so, we get one of these, right? And then what do you do? You just like click on it? Yeah, yeah. I love it. Mr. Sloan, that was an excellent idea, my friend. Thank you so much. Let me go like so, and then we will make this chest. All right, and I'm just making this chest right now. I mean, it's, it's one of those like dump and run kind of deals. So we're just going to dump all the stuff that we can dump in there all we really need is this and this uh what else do we need uh, we might as well keep that out for now and that should be good yes yes okay so now i need to grind out some more gravel and get two more diamonds so let me go off camera and do that and then we're going to try to make some auto hammers we'll get those set up and we'll make sure that we're getting power we got to be a little careful because i think each one of them makes 20 r takes 20 rf a tick and if i've got six that's like 120 rf just for the hammers and then i need another 60 so that means I need 180 RF a tick. I might have to get another windmill going. Let me see if I can't grind out these diamonds, and I'll be back with you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. So I ground out, I don't know, it's like four or five stacks of gravel, and I actually got a whole bunch of diamonds. I got seven more, plus a whole bunch of other stuff. I need to get this out of here. Copper, man. Copper is an issue for sure. I don't know why I took all that. There's no reason. Let's put this uh, back in here. Okay, like that. All right, let's go over and put our copper in our smelter. I don't, well, I sort of, I don't want it to mix. So we're getting tons of iron here. This thing is still cranking out. Let's just leave this copper in our inventory for just a second. Let's put it up there. I also made a little bit more clay so I could get some hardened clay. So I could do uh, some hardened, so I, we could make some more connectors. Because if we're going to use wind power and immersive engineering wiring connections, I think we're going to be okay. We could do it that way. I think, I think, I think. I think, I think. All right, so what's the story here? Let's start making some auto hammers. And we need to make five of these bad boys. So to do that, we need this. So let's take this out of here. And then I'm going to need some iron. So let's go get a stack of our iron ingots that we're cranking out over here. We'll take these and we'll move this over here. Just so we can sort of keep a little bit of organizational deal going on here now, if I... All right, let's just use our thing on a stick, man. <laughs> I love it. All right, so we need, we're going to need 10 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10. Okay, 10 of those. And then we're going to need five of, oh, dang it, no sticks. There's four. Okay, and then we can go like this. I need to get used to that crafting table. Uh, we need some more sticks course we do let's do this one two go like that and then we could go like this and we'll have a ton of sticks okay crafting table on a stick firing it up okay auto hammer we need five of these guys one two three four five one two three four five okay and then we should be able to make these guys right not this one you so we can go like that and it's just one. Man, earlier, my neighbor started mowing the grass, man. I hate that. <laughs> because that means I'm going to have to mow my grass. You guys probably know how that works if you live like in a, you know, a housing development or something like that. 
soon as your neighbor starts going to work, then you have to go to work. Okay, so there's our five, six. Okay, six auto hammer. So let's go and get these set up. I think we probably want to bring this forward some a little bit. Let's get rid of this tree. Oh, that's not really what I wanted to do, but I'll do it. So we're going to have to have our tree operation in another location. Not that we're in too bad shape for wood. I mean, we've got a good amount. But let's... Um, do I have a slab somewhere? And we'll switch that out. Oh, I don't see any. Oh, there's a piece of hardened clay. Sweet, I'll take that. All right, we will put this in there. Um, this little bit of gravel can go in here. Okay. Okay. Cobblestone generator. Let's bring that along. Let's bring item transfer nodes. And we should have some pipe laying around. I'm going to have to make some more, I bet. Okay. All right, let's get this thing set up. Do I have what I need? I have to make some meshes, but let's get the hammers going first. Uh, we're going to have to make some more wire connectors. So let's do that. How am I doing with copper? Four. Okay, I think that's enough to make. I mean, I keep wanting to go over there to that thing. So connector. We should be able to make four more of those guys. Okay, that should be enough. Uh, it's going to be one short ultimately, but that's okay. We can take care of it. Um, let me get some building blocks. How about some dirt since we have a little bit of going on here? All right, so we're going to do... What did I say we're going to do? We're going to do... I want to start over this way a little bit because I'm going to have another windmill, I think. I guess it doesn't really matter. We can put it right here. So we're going to have crate, crate, crate. Okay? And then we're going to have sieve, sieve, sieve. Okay, so this guy over here needs one auto hammer, like so. All right, this guy over here needs two auto hammers. Shift up like that. And this guy over here needs one, two, three. Okay, like that right there. Okay, and then we need to do a couple things here. So first of all, we're going to need to get another relay. How's this guy doing? Oh, man, it's almost clear full. Um, I guess we could put the relay here like there, right? Yep, and feed all these guys off these connectors. So we could go connector, 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 connector. Okay? And then I need six pieces of wire, and I think I have it. We're gonna need some more copper. Oh, I only have five pieces of wire. Any more wire laying around? No, okay. We need to get this copper smelting up because we're gonna have to make some wire ASAP. Let's get... I don't think that's going to combine. If that combines, I'm going to be super duper sad. I don't think. I don't think. Man, I got to I got to check first. Okay. Copper. Oh, copper. Okay. Um, what can I do with copper? Smelting, okay. Is there like an alloy deal? Okay, it doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it. So, let's throw that in there. Oh my goodness. I'm so nervous because that's literally all the copper that I have. Let's see. Let's hope for the best. <laughs> Why not? So, let's go here. And then we can go uh, from here to here to the relay. And then from the relay to this guy. Relay to... Uh, we should break over there. Relay there, there, and there. And then that's the end of my wire, right? Okay. So we're definitely going to need some more wire. But these guys now should be filling up with power. They are. It's pulling power out of this guy. Right? At a pretty good rate. And I want to see oh, I want to see once they're full. Because we're not we haven't done anything with them yet, right? So this guy is going to be for uh, gravel. These two are going to be making sand. And these three are going to be making dust. Okay? Yeah. All right. Now, we need some more iron. Did it mix? No. Okay, awesome. Let's grab some more iron out of here. Let's grab that. Because we need three auto sieves now. And let's see what we need to do to make those. So, sieve. Auto sieve. So, we need to make a couple blocks of iron. So, we're going to need to make six blocks of iron. Let's make one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Let's grab these guys back. 
What else do we need? And then we need two pieces of iron a piece. We're going to need some glass panes, and we're going to need 12 of those. Somewhere I have glass. Oh, we'll get that out of there. Put that in our stack. There we go. Got some glass there. And now we can go glass panes. Okay. We got those now. I think I have some glass in here, too. I'm going to throw that in there. Okay. Awesome. We had a couple glass panes, but eh, whatever. It is what it is. And then we need to make a couple sieves. So let's get that part done. I should have sticks. I do. So let's get some more of these guys. Let's open up our crafting table on a stick. <laughs> and we got to make some slabs. That should be good. Now, we got to make three of these guys. One, two, three. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Now, can we make these guys? Bang. Three of them. Burp. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. We needed some more connectors, but we'll get copper here in a minute. Okay, now, these guys are going to go... So we got an auto hammer here. Or no, sieve here and here. Actually, you know what we're going to do? Let me do this right here. Okay. If I go over here to the anvil, we got to eat something. All right, who am I... Here, I'm going to do this. We're going to put this right here. We're going to put one of these guys in here. And we're going to call this Andrew R73. I think that Andrew uh, R73. I hope that works. Let's see if this, if we put this down, if it's a picture of Andrew. Um, no. Oh, I thought that worked. Maybe I don't have his in-game name right. Hmm. Oh. Well, let's just put him down. And I'll come back. Well, no, I need to figure that out. I'll tell you what, let me go make sure I get his in-game name correct. And then... I can name these. I think that works in this pack. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I don't want to name it myself. I know what my in-game name is. Let me just check with uh, him real quick, and I'll bring you right back. We'll see if we can't get that to work. I've got a couple levels of experience. I should be okay. Let me do that, and I'll see you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. I guess this whole naming thing doesn't work anymore. Man, I thought it did. I know it works in uh, Forever Stranded, even though I don't have any sieves going. If that does work... Please tell me how to make. Uh, I don't, man. I don't want these random people as my slaves in a box. I want like my friends, man. If you're not gonna like enslave your friends, what kind of person are you? All right, let's grab this copper out of here. We got to go make some more connectors and we got to make some more wire, right? Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, craft table and a stick. Uh, let's look at connectors. We got to make a couple more. So it's four more should get the job done. Okay. And then I need to find my engineering hammer, which should be laying around here somewhere. Yep. And I should have some, uh, do I have snips? Engineering snips? Or was I using a set of shears? Here, let's see. Can we do this? Let's see if this works. I don't know if it's going to, but we will find out here. To... Dang it. Stone. One, two. Let's see if this works. Okay, so we need some more wire. And how many more pieces of wire do I need? Because I get four with each combined. So if I go like this, and I can go one, two, three. Oh, dag nabbit. How are we going to get power into these things? How are we going to do... Our, well, I guess we could go in the front. Yeah, uh, yeah, that'll work. We could go on the front for power. So I need one, two, three, four, five pieces of wire, I'm guessing. Is this thing... Okay, we're going to have to see what this thing is under load, maybe. Okay, so let's make some more wire. You guys should know how to do that already. If you don't, then shame on you. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We need eight pieces of wire. So let's see if we can use these stone shears. Nope, I guess they have to be iron. Let's see. Yeah, how do I make wire cutters? Oh, an iron ingot and some sticks? I thought for sure I had wire cutters. All those chests are gone over there. Ah, right there. Oh, we just saved ourselves. Okay. So we go like this, and we go like that, and we make some wire. And then I think it's just a stick in the middle, and then back and forth like that. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now, 
we should be able to go relay here, relay here, relay here, relay here, and relay there. Oh, that's like a, that's, oh man, it's so sweet. It's like a spider web. Oh, I love it. I love that. Okay. Now, all these guys should be loading up with power. They are beautiful. Butamus. It's butamus is what it is. All right, we got to make some uh, meshes. So let's get some string out of here. And we're going to make some iron meshes. I think that's what we decided to do, right? So uh, mesh, we're going to make some... I, just, I know I came over here to my crafting thing. Uh, we need one, two, three. Okay. And we should be able to go over here. Let's get these guys down like this. And then we're going to do that there, that there, and that there. Okay, these guys all have meshes now. So they're getting power. Now we just need to move the items, right? Oh, man, I hate the fact that we are going to have to do this on the bottom or on the front side. And there's really not any way. Oh, you know what? I wonder. I wonder. How many of those little disc things do I have? Does, are those going to work? Maybe we could just go like, oh, we have six. Okay. Uh, I need, how many do I need? I need a couple. <laughs> oh, how am I going to get down there? Oh, I don't want to do that, like drop it off the side of the world type thing. I could do it for the ones in the middle. Right? Um, actually, let's just test to see if this is even going to work. Okay. We're going to go one of these there and then put this back. Okay, and put the mesh in there. And then we need to go around and connect our wire again. So let's do this and then this and this. Okay. So this guy now should be firing up with power. Okay. Now we just need to give it some cobblestone. Let's let it, let's let one of these run. Do I have like a stack of cobblestone somewhere? We'll just go, go like this. And then the goal is to see if this thing is actually going to do what it needs to do. Okay, so that's running. Now the question is will it drop that in there using those little these little flat things? If so, man, that's going to be amazing. Oh, it did. It did. It did. Okay. Here, let me put this in here. We'll speed up the process a little bit. I'm going to see if we can actually see it. Yeah, okay, that's working like a dream. Okay, let's, um, how many, we got five of these? So we can go one there. Here, man, we're going to, we're just going to go all crazy here for sure. Okay, let me grab up all this stuff. We're going to need it. Okay, one of these there, and we're going to go like this. Yep, and then one of these here, and then we can put our hammer back, right? And then we'll have to hook up power again, but that's it is what it is. Why is that guy working? He's not. Okay. Oh no, that's wrong. Okay, we gotta do hammer, hammer, and then sieve at the bottom. So let's put this back and that. And that. Okay. All right, let's go around here and make sure we collect all of our pieces parts. We need uh, uh, connector, connector. That's amazing. I love that so much, how that works just uh, sweet like that. Okay, there, and then here, and here. Okay, get him back up and running. All right, we have three more, which is enough to get all these guys hooked up. Let's take all these out. I know we just built that, but man, we're, we're doing something cool here. So we're going to go here, and then we're going to go... We need hammers, so we're going to go like this, and then another one of these guys here, and then we're going to go like this. And then we can put this guy back like so. This, and then this. Okay? And I have more transfer nodes... How, no, uh, I think that maybe we'll just do it like that because eventually I'm going to have an ender chest here, right? Yep, I still need to get transfer nodes on the bottom of those things. Dang it. Okay, I have a solution though. We need a single piece of redstone. Let's get that. We got some planks. We need some cobble. Okay. And then we need to go here and we need to make a piston. Do you guys know how to do this, man? I'm sure you do. Man, you guys are smart. 
You guys know all about it. Do I have any sticks? I do. We need a lever now. So let's get uh, a lever. Okay, we got that. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my axe and I'm going to go chop, chop, chop. Is that right? Yeah. And then I'm going to go like this. Right? And then I'm going to go like this. We're going to go up here. And we're going to go like that. Okay? We're we're gonna we're gonna do some heavy duty cheating around here is what we're gonna do. We're gonna put that nope, nope. Can I put that down? I want it to face down. Okay. I'm not worried about it. Are you worried about it? No. We'll just go up a little higher. That's okay. And we'll put this there. Okay. And then we will take this. And we'll put this like that. And then we'll put this. Now watch this, right? So if we take this out, you guys probably are just like, hey man, I know exactly what you're doing. You're a super cheater. <laughs> we'll go like that, and we'll come back up. Yep, push it on down there. And then we just stick another one of these in there, and we go like that, and up. And then we'll go like that, and up. All right, now we have a little thing going down there. And I don't know how far... Okay, that's perfect. Let's jump back up here. We can clear out all this mess that we have. Okay, look at that guy. He's working like a dream. Okay, beautiful. All right, now, the last thing we need to do is we need... Well, I don't know if it's the last thing. We need this, our anvil back. Actually, we don't need our anvil back. We just said we were going to use normal thing. I don't know how long this episode is. It feels like it's going super long, but at the same time, man, we're getting our work on. So we're going to drop down here and we're going to go do, do, do. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now this, uh, do I have a torch? No, I sort of want to leave that down there and we'll cover it, cover it back up. Do I have a torch? Um, no. But I have some coal somewhere. Let's get a piece of coal. Let's make a couple torches. I'm just going to put a torch on that thing so we can leave it down there. Because eventually, we'll probably want to set that back up and get even lower. Right? So, let's do that. And let's go over here and we'll just put uh, a torch down on that guy. And then we should have these guys we can take back. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So, we got those on there. That should work. Now we just need to do one more thing. And I'm sorry if this is a long episode. Maybe not. I mean, we're we're grinding it out. So I'm not too worried about it. We need to make a storage crate. Storage crate. Oh, actually, we need a compressor, don't we? We can make a auto compressor. No. Auto compressor. Iron. Yeah. Yeah, I think think maybe that's what we want to do do we No, i don't think so i think we're long in this episode already so let's see what we need to make for a storage crate all right i don't think we can make the big daddy ones because we don't have void crystal blocks yet but we will someday okay so we need to make uh, no we need to make these so let's make one two three four okay and then we need to make this i don't have a piece of wood Let's get one. Okay. I should be using my crafting table on a stick. Sorry, Mr. Sloan. I always forget. All right. There we go for that. And then we're going to be able to go bang. Oh, do I not have planks now? Dang thing. Here, give me these back, you dang guy. Okay. And then we should be able to go like this and get ourselves a storage crate. Okay. I mean, it's not the best solution so far, but man, I think it'll work. Do we have our pipes? We do. Okay, now we should be able to go right here in the front, like so. And we should be able to come around the back side here. And we should be able to go like this, and this, and this. And if everything's working properly, we should be getting items. It's a fluid transfer node. Oh my lord. I'm glad we didn't tear all that stuff down. Idiot. Do I have...
please tell me I have item transfer nodes. You guys are probably like, hey man, that's the wrong node. Oh, dang it. Okay, so I don't have the thing that I need. How can I get around it? I mean, I guess I could run these things straight in. Let's do that. Um, and then I can always pull stuff out of those storage things into an ender chest. Or I can just swap them out with ender chest if I want to down the road. Let's do that. Oh my goodness, I know we're super long in this episode. Not a whole lot I can do about it. So let's make, we got to make some more storage crates. Let's get a stack of wood out of here and stop messing around. That should be good. We're going to definitely need one, two of those. The rest of these we can turn into that. And I'm going to need eight chests. So let's go and get eight of those. Storage crate here. We don't have any sticks. Of course not. Let's go like that. Oh man, I think we're going to be not have enough. Just want sticks. Okay, sticks. Okay, storage crate now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So we got to do this. the deal here? What do I need? Oh, I need wood. Okay. And now I don't have an enough. One, two. Oh, no. I'm good. That's good. Right? Small storage crate. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stop, stop flipping out for no reason. Alright, I can do that. And then I need a little bit more planks, right? And I should be able to make a third one. Yep. Okay. Now, Let's get our anvil. Do I have an open space? I do. So let's get our anvil back. And now we'll open up this. And we're going to go this. Yeah, items. Anvil. Squish them. Okay. Okay. Now, we can go back over here. We can drop down. And we can go boop, boop, boop. Right? Okay. Let's chop this out. Let's jump up here. Let's put these back so we don't like randomly fall into that hole. Now, let's get our storage crates and we should be able to go do, do, do. Okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Working like a dream. I love it. All right, we can put that in there like so. Okay, now all we need to do is, and then we're going to be done. We have one last item node and we've got a bunch of pipes. So we've got to hook up this deal. And we might have to make another, I don't know, um, how do we upgrade that? 64 blocks, every 20 ticks, okay, let's, let's do that quick. Man, I'm sorry if this is long, but this is ore processing, man, this is where it's at. This is so we can just sit back and just chill for now. Um, I have this, I don't need to use that. Put this in the middle like so, and we're going to surround it. I don't know if this will be enough. If not, we'll upgrade it again. You know, we can do that if we want to. Let's go up here. Okay, now where are we going to put this thing? So we got to go up high enough to be able to get stuff out of it into there. Let's go up one more block, and we're going to set this guy. Okay? Take some fall damage, but that should be okay. Okay, and then... Hopefully, I have enough item transfer node. Bang. And then we're going to go doot, 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 do. Will that feed both of these? This guy might have to get filled up first, but that's okay. It should work. And then we should be able to go like straight across here like that. Okay, and then this thing should. Yeah, so those are all. Oh, look at that. They're all working. Hee, hee, hee. All right, that's working like a dream. Everything's working downstream. Uh, no mesh. Let's put these back in. We broke those. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. That's working. Yeah. And that's working. Okay. And then let's go get one, two, three, four. And we're going to waste a little bit more materials, but that's okay. Let's make ourselves a couple hammers like this. Um, like this. 
and we'll put these guys we'll put one we'll put a double one in here so this guy's gonna run twice as fast um, I don't know if that's actually something we need to worry about probably not that may have been a little bit of a waste but ah, it's okay we'll stick it in there anyway and let's have this guy run in ah, we'll just do it like that okay so that should work so everything should be coming downstream right this guy has no power because we broke him okay let's get a connector and a piece of wire now the big question is do I have enough power connector one two three and then wire here here and here everybody should be connected now everybody should be rolling right along all right now here's the big question how are we doing as far as power are we still gaining power no it's hard to say Okay, I know we're super long in this episode, and I apologize that it's a long, big one, but you guys never seem to mind. You always are like, hey, man, don't worry about it. <laughs> Look at that. We're getting all of our materials. We are taking care of business. That's awesome. I love it so much. Everything's happening downstream. We're getting all the pieces, parts. Where's my redstone at, man? Should be coming right in there, right? So that should be doing dust. Here, I can actually stick that in there. And then we should get it back. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I got to see when these guys get filled up with power. I mean, they're still gaining power. So let's just wait one second here. That one's full. And then I want to see what this thing looks like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And how much is this guy? 20. So everybody's using 20 RF a tick. Are these guys still filling up? Yeah, we're definitely losing power. So next time, uh, between the episodes, I'm going to fire up another windmill, get that done, and then we're going to see about maybe making some end stone and getting some ender pearls so we can make some ender chests, and then we got to find a place to put all this stuff that we're making. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it so much. We got a pretty cool little ore processing setup, man. We're grinding out all the stuff. Let me know if you think we need to run any of those other meshes. We can do that as well. Until next time, though, please remember to be cool. Don't be a fool. And from the sky where, man, we're hammering stone and sieving out the goodies. I guess we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody. Thank you.